Mark Ray Mundy back with you here for ESPN with a special guest, Yuri Prohaska, who is, of course, challenging for the UFC light heavyweight title against Glover Teixeira at UFC 275 on June 11th in Singapore. I really, I really want to ask you, uh, I've been looking forward to this, uh, this interview, Yuri, because I feel like a lot of uh, maybe the American fans uh, don't know everything about you yet. You know, you're, you're still kind of new to the UFC in a sense. We've seen your, your highlight reel, you know, finishes, but we don't really know the man, you know, Yuri. Uh, so mm-hmm. tell me, like, what, first, what was it like growing up in the Czech Republic? And, and I mean, you've been to the United States. How, how different is it there than it might be in, in the U.S.? I was started with, uh, with the training in my, in my 17, in my 17, here in, in Brno. Uh, that's the second biggest city in the Czech Republic, okay. and uh, there I started uh, with uh, with Muay Thai, with Muay Thai, and uh, just a little karate and judo, and and uh, I was very 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 wild wild guy who's who's like to who's like to to fight on the street with like uh, like like some street fights and. That martial arts gave me some rules to to my life, and I just keep I just keep, I was kept going uh, in uh, in uh, in this in the training in the in the fighting in the competition, and that's that was very helpful for me, for for my for my life and uh, and now I'm here now I'm here. How many uh, how living? Many street, li- how many street fights would you say uh, you've been in in your life? <laughs> uh, I, 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 I don't uh, I don't count the, I, I didn't I didn't count that but it was a lot but I I was like uh, I found I was founded for for um, for for something in in that in these in these street fights I was uh, found for for what's the what's the best move in this in this uh, in this situation? What's the best strategy to what to do? Uh, how to how to punch better? And after after some years of the martial arts, that gave me especially what I was looking for. So so I'm very glad for for that. I was born. I think I was I was bo- I was born for that. And now I'm here. More than ten street fights, more than fifteen. What? What? Yeah, like a actually, ballpark figure? More than, more than, I think more than one hundred. <laughs> more than one hundred. Yeah, sure. Yeah, that did was. You, did you uh, win them all? Every that was every that was every weekend. Every weekend. Wow. Did you Did you win them all? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Okay. All right. I guess yeah. you got to say that, right? <laughs> yeah. You have to. You have to because that was that was about not just about. What you win, what you lose. That was about the reputation, and you, and I, I, I wanted to be. I wanted. I was. Uh, I was look looking for uh, for to be to be the best to be the best guy uh, on the street fighting in the in the city in the republic. <laughs> Would you say that that fighting in the street is what brought you to martial arts? That's what made you yeah. want to train. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That's true. That's true. Just, just a young, young wild guy who has, uh, who have uh, had a lot of energy, and martial arts gave me, gave me the, gave me the, the place where to give it, where to give the, this energy. That's all. I've, I've seen that you, that you've studied like, uh, like bushido and like some of the, some of like the ancient, yeah. uh, you know, Eastern um, arts. Can you tell me how you picked that up and, and why? That was after some years of, of studying martial arts. Uh, when 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 the second coach, uh, because I have uh, two coaches, two coaches all my career. Uh, the second coach when he when he came to to, to our team, uh, he gave me the book of of book of five rings from uh, Miyamoto Musashi's and uh, and and there was. Uh, there was rules, Bushido, Bushido moral, moral codes, Bushido moral codes, and 
that gave me the basement, the the base for for uh, uh, for 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 the martial arts. Something which I which I can use for for myself, like for a person in every in daily situation. Yeah, and uh, I like that. I, I started to live that. I started to live that, and and I'm I'm so and I'm so glad for 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 that that he he was he, he helped me a lot with with these with these rules. How, how would you say uh, it may have changed your life, or maybe changed your behavior? Ooh. <laughs> I think it was. It was, uh, it was a uh, full, full change of my, full change of myself, full change of myself because, uh, because uh, I was another, another person. I was another person and, and I'm glad for that. And I'm just, I, I, I'm keeping that that uh, chaos from this youngest time in myself still, but I I want to show it just in the cage, As, just in the cage, straight to the victory. Where where would you say that energy uh, comes from? Is it just I mean, is it anger? Is it rage? What what, what how would you describe it? Ah, uh, that was just uh, just pure pure energy, and and I I was. I was all all my life from 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 my child from my childhood. I was all the time li like that. To, to I have a lot of energy, and uh, teachers uh, teachers have a big problem with me in the, in the school. And my parents have, <laughs> they had they had a, they had a great good, uh, big problem to how to how to keeping me keeping me uh, keeping me on the place <laughs> how how old were you um, when your coach gave you the book from uh, musashi Ooh, around around 19 or 12 20 yeah 19 20 something like that something like that, yeah would would you consider it almost like uh almost like a religion or something in in that in that same breath yeah for me for me it's something like that for me, something like that. But religion, but religion. I don't believe in religion because uh, the modern, 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 uh, modern human have to know there is there there is no religion. There is just uh, energy, energy of belief. What you believe, that's that's your that's your religion. Yeah. And it can be whatever. <laughs> so that's my angle of, of, of view. So you were so you were doing um, as a teen, you were doing some Muay Thai, some striking arts. When did you actually first and why did you first start doing MMA? I started with MMA. Uh, uh, at my uh, in my pool. 1819 okay 18, 18, 19, and I started with that because I was uh, I like that I, I like that uh, uh, that free uh, free movement that free movement uh, no no big gloves like in Muay Thai uh, free movements and and uh, and you I just I, I just uh, like that to be more free than than Muay, than in Muay Thai to to have a to have a every movement uh, to use that for for attacking for defending especially for especially and for attacking <laughs> and <laughs> yeah because that's 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 uh that's about the strategy strategy strategic idea every every move must be must be useful and uh, like uh, like uh, 
it must be like uh, going straight, like attack, not not defend. Every every move must must be attacking. And you you no, still you still live by that. You still you yeah. still fight like that. Yeah, yeah. You have to. You have to because some some guys they 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 took that they take that like a like a playing like MMA is playing. No, for me is. Uh, uh, I'm taking that like a, like a way of warrior, yeah. And it's it's about uh, life and death, on one side and the second side, and you have to be one hundred one hundred percent successful if you want to win. If you want to win, that means you 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 can you can you 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 can live. If you are not, you are die. You die. One one of the things you know I, I thought was interesting is that you know your your first big promotion after you leave Czech Republic as a fighter after you leave Europe is you go to Japan and you fight for Ryzen. Was that important to you because of the Bushido teachings that you have learned and you have studied to go to Japan and fight there first? Yeah, that was uh, that was a good uh, that was a good good circum circumstance because because my coach gave me that book and after one or two years uh, they gave me the offer from rising to 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 fight there and and i'm very i'm very glad for these for these five years in japan which gave me uh these skills with uh with the high level guys with the high level opponents and to be to be the to be ready for the best best level which is UFC which which is UFC and and now I'm here for 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 to take the to take the crown and you actually I think you uh, you got offered from the UFC even before you left right like years earlier you could have gone to the UFC but you decided not to yes yes that's that's true and uh, i was uh i was wanted to to take that to take that to take the, that chance but my coaches they uh they they keep me keep me keeping me back every time because they have to i i'm still going forward going forward with, with full power and they 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 said me uh look Win, win the belt here in the rising. Uh, took, uh, take a more skills from from here from these high level opponents there, and then we can go to the UFC and beat these uh, top guys and take the take the belt. I said, okay, let's go, let's do that, let's do that. So, so I started, I started to, uh, I started to, to keep working, keep working. I saw. So you have, of course, this this big fight coming up. You're fighting for the UFC light heavyweight title against Glover Teixeira. It it seems to me like you know martial arts and and fighting is uh is really. I mean, it's your life, and it's like something that you know you've studied. It's and it's almost religious for you. Yeah. Does winning the UFC title hold a lot of importance? Because it feels like you you you're almost like a you know. It doesn't matter if you win or lose the title. It's more about your expression. But is it important for you to win the title? Yes, sure. <laughs> Every, uh, but it's more important for me. It's more important to win the fight, to win the fight, and how to win the fight. How I will show my uh, my skills, my evolve from my last fight till this fight. That's for me the most important because all these fighting. Is about evolving. For for me, is everything for me in, in in this life is about evolution, to be better, to understand better, to express better. Yeah, and yeah, that's what about is. I I feel like and, and correct me if I'm if I'm wrong here, but you remind me a little bit of, of Justin Gaethje in a sense because you you fight like you're not afraid to lose. Uh, you, do, you, do you understand? Do you understand what I mean? Do you yes, feel that way? Yes, and and yes, does yes. does losing even matter to you? Because it feels like you're 
you're so focused on, you know, your offense and, and your expression. No, 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 uh, no, it's not, it's not like that. Uh, okay. I'm not, uh, I have not like, uh, uh, I'm not like, uh, I don't feel fear from, from losing. Yeah. I feel all these emotion, but I know what is mean and I don't need it. I know these, I don't need this, uh, this emotion of fear. So I started to, to work with my mind how to how to uh, how to uh, re, re, uh, how to uh, how to find it how to find this emotion and how to uh, like do do away with it yes yes yeah yes yeah, so, sorry for that yeah it's no. it's very simple it's a very simple. That's 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 what is that's what is uh, the 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 meditation all these things about. Yeah, it's a very simple and it's straight. It's straight. It have to be. Do you, it have to do be. You, do you meditate often? Uh, when I need, when I need, I do that. So so winning the UFC title, it is important to you. It's very important to you. It is a part or, or of my is the journey. journey. More important it is a part. No, the UFC title is a part of the journey, and I, I can just say, I will. I will do everything to to achieve that, and that's all. Do you you have a family? Do you have like a, a wife and kids? Uh, no. No, no okay. just uh, I, not just just the, just the, just a girlfriend. Just okay. a girlfriend. So, is your would you say your focus is primarily on on fighting and martial arts? Yes, everything in my life is uh, is going by the by this MMA and by this fighting style lifestyle. That's why I'm living in the in the forest. Uh, in the cottage where I have the playground for uh, to for to, to punching the bags to to lift off the weights to to run to run in the in the in uh, in this fortress sprints and for every, every everything everything in my life is is ruled ruled by by this lifestyle. So you're you're just isolated like in in the forest right now. For the yeah. last few weeks, for the last few weeks, months, not last few weeks, months. I'm living months. there. Not no, I'm I'm living there. Living there, yeah. In the cottage. So you so you wake up in it's like a cabin. Yeah, yeah. Wow, cabin, Co cabin, cottage, somewhere. cottage. Yeah. yeah, and just just you or your your coaches also. No, 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 no. Me, just just me. That's my, that's that's where I where I'm living. <laughs> wow, wow. So yeah. and and you train you train in that space as well? Yeah. Yeah, okay. I have there there I have there the special special space for a training. Yeah. How far away from uh, the city is it? From uh and half hour, half hour. Half hour, okay. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, you're I mean, you're kind of you're kind of like the modern day samurai. You're like that's like that's kind of what No, I'm I'm not I'm I'm not saying that, but but <laughs> I'm just doing what is necessary uh, to be the best, yeah. And 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 if I have to uh, live like that, think but think like that, and uh, eat like that, I will do. I, I I will just do that because I want that. That's all. <laughs> what is what is the ultimate goal? Like what what is the thing that you're you know that you want to accomplish most? Like how do you see this journey going? Yeah. And uh, it's mastery. It's a mastery. In mastery in uh, every part of life. Yeah. So not so it goes beyond fighting. No, it's it's man. I I I, I can't be uh, focused just just uh, just for a, for a fighting because it will be it will be it will be very. Uh, I will be so tired from that because I, I live i live like that to be to be focused just just for the fighting for the fighting for the fighting no no vacation no nothing and 
it was uh, I started to be uh, to be bored bored by that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. because not not bored, but uh, I'm doing the martial arts because I love that because I have the big passion for 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 for, uh, for the martial arts for these movements for the to be for these evolving in that to be better and better so so i have to keep keep that fire in my from in my heart still in in a in a full in a full power just the last couple of things and i appreciate the time of course yuri uh, glover Teixeira, veteran of the game he's going to be your opponent you know, diverse guy, very good on the ground, good, good standing up. How do you view him, and what do you see as his, his strengths and weaknesses? For me, for me, it's very, very simple. Uh, I am stand up guy, and he is a ground game guy, and that's that's all. That's all. You don't think he'll he'll stand up with you? What? One more time. You don't think he'll he'll strike with you? Uh, maybe, maybe he will, uh, he will try to surprise me, but I think, uh, no, I don't want to, I, I don't, I don't want to think about that because when you, when you started to think about something like, like that, uh, you have, you will keep that for the fight and that's, that's bad. You can't, <laughs> you can't, you can't think in the fight. I will I will leave that on the for, for the moment of fight yeah uh, because because uh, this moment when he will be before before me in in the cage that will be uh, the moment where uh, where the true power for me and where the where the all the techniques how to beat him will come to me that's that's all that's why i don't want to predict the fights uh and talk about the fights i i just want to be quiet in that in that in these in the in these things we uh and and keep working so you, you say you don't you don't think when you're fighting there's no there's no thought it's just uh you have to you have to no, you have to you have to be there like uh, control the control the emotion, control the thinking, and the mind mind <laughs> uh, mind have to be like uh, like a weapon, yeah. Hmm. The mind have to give you just this idea, this idea, this idea. Hey, there is a space. There is an, uh, this angle is good. This speed he 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 can't react, yeah. And all these things, you can just okay, mm, no, okay, okay. I will use that. So it's very simple when you when you when you uh, when you see see the fighting like that, but. Uh, it's not simple. It's very hard to achieve that, to be on that level, to be so free and see the things like that. How, how long would you say it took you to get to that level? It's, that's the way. That's the way. That's the, that's the way to the mastery. And um, I'm, still, I'm, still, I'm still growing. I'm still working. What would you say is the most important thing that fans should know about you, about Yuri Prohaska? Uh, the most important thing, I'm just a uh, just, uh, normal guy who, who likes the most beautiful moves in the cage. And I, I want to I wanna show that. I want to show that this beauty of martial arts for all the people that's all that, that's all i like that because because i'm inspired by these games like mortal kombat and tekken where where these uh where these uh where these characters they punch punches and 
they react like uh, with uh, uh, with endurance, with no end, with no ending. Yeah, uh, they are, their techniques is most persist, most persist, and yeah, <laughs> that's why that's why <laughs> I like it. Yeah. When, when you were in Japan, did you visit any like uh, any like temples or shrines, anything like like Bushido places that meant that meant something to you? Yeah, yeah, that was a lot of things, but I don't want to speak about that because I have to keep it inside. I understand the coach that, that gave you the book of the five rings. What's his name? Yaroslav, Yaroslav Ovezan. I'm probably gonna have to ask you for the spelling of that uh, <laughs> after <laughs> after the interview, but <laughs> okay, okay. But I but I appreciate it. That's all I have for you, man. Yuri, thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Good luck, June 11th, UFC 275 against Wilfred Sierra, UFC light heavyweight title. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube for live streaming sports and premium content. Subscribe to ESPN Plus.